Hello friends, back to problem analysis. It's me Jaseem. If you are interested in problem solving and if you know the basic geometry and the congruency of triangles, then here is an interesting problem. Consider a square. A triangle is constructed inside this square as shown in the figure. Two angles are given as 45 degree and 70 degree. Then my problem is, what is this red marked angle? If you want to attempt the problem, pause the video and just give a try. And the solution is right here. First analyze what are given in the problem. Firstly, the outer rectangle is a square. And then, two angles are given as 45 degree and 70 degree. Now remember what is our aim of this problem. It is nothing but to find the red marked angle. This is the structure of our problem, so always keep in mind. Our problem is to find an angle. So the first thing we have to do is to find all the possible angles in the figure. Since the outer rectangle is a square, the corners will be right angle. Now look at this right triangle. The bottom angle will be 90 minus 70 equal to 20 degree. Then the remaining angle in this corner will be 90 minus 45 minus 20 equal to 25 degree. Now consider this right triangle. The remaining angle will be 90 minus 25 equal to 65 degree. That's all. No more angles are obvious. But still, we have to find this angle. So there should be some trick. That is what I am going to do next. Let's denote the missing angle by x. Now, consider the bottom right triangle. Take a copy of this triangle and join it with the right edge of the square. Then a bigger triangle will form here. And note that its bottom angle will be 20 plus 25 equal to 45 degree. To understand why we are doing this, we need to note one important fact about congruent triangles. Consider two triangles. Suppose that two pairs of sides are equal to each other and their interior angles are also equal. Then they are congruent triangles or equal triangles. That is, simply speaking, two triangles are congruent to each other if and only if two pairs of sides and their interior angles are equal to each other. Now come back to our figure and I am giving some notations to each vertex. Observe the triangles CQR and CQP. Note that angle PCQ is equal to angle RCQ. Both are 45 degree. The side QC is common for both triangles. And finally, PC equal to RC. Because by our construction, both of these blue shaded right triangles are identical. Thus, PC and RC are equal. Now these three equalities implies two sides and their interior angle are equal for both triangles. Then by the property we told PCQ and RCQ are congruent triangles. That means the remaining pair of sides are equal. That is PQ equal to RQ. The remaining angles are also pairwise equal. That is from the figure angle PQC and angle RQC are equal and that is equal to 70 degree. Also, angle CPQ and angle CRQ are equal which is equal to 65 degree. But the angle CPQ was the angle we wanted to find. So in the diagram of our problem, the red marked angle is equal to 65 degree and that is the solution we are looking for. And that's all about this video. My Gmail ID and Instagram ID are given in the description. So if you have any queries regarding the subject, please feel free to contact. Thank you so much for watching. Meet you in the next video with another interesting problem.